Any enemy material captured in the area of operations can be analyzed by JDeal. Generally speaking, capturing units are called collectors. Our safety prevails, so the first step is a triage servant, whatever the case is. However, the other role of the triage cell is to collect information from the collector. This is also the way to determine the priority of the case. At any step, exhibits have to be protected against cross-contamination. Triage will check exhibits. X-raying is a common way to check for safety. After the triage cell, the evidence custodian is the following step. Evidence custodian is in charge of tracking and storing exhibits. No explosive exhibit will enter evidence custody. Only small parts of the explosive material go directly from triage to chemistry cell. The triage servant takes care of the safety within the laboratory. Once checked, the exhibits will be introduced into the laboratory. Inside the laboratory, all the exhibits will be photographed. The photographer will start with general pictures. Then, exhibits will be processed by experts. There is a need for coordination between them to secure that exhibits will be thoroughly examined in proper order. Most of the exhibits will be processed by the forensic exploitation cell. They will look for latent prints and DNA. Fingerprints and DNA traces will be secured for further research. All the results of the research in the laboratory will be checked and stored in the database of the laboratory. Once all the research results are completed, an overall report can be distributed back into the operational domain.